All right, so here it says what is 3 times the square root of 250 expressed in simplest radical form. So I want to think of the radical 250 first. I'm going to break it up into two factors. I see radical 25 times radical 10, right? And here I'm, I'm just using this property that you can break up the square root of a number into the square root of its factors. So I know 25 times 10 is 250. This also means that the square root of 25 times the square root of 10 is the square root of 250. Um, and here, square root of 25, we can think of that as just 5. And the square root of 10, there are no perfect squares in there, so we're kind of at a, at a stopping point. But here, it's 3 times right radical 250. So 3 times 5 square root of 10, which is 15 square root of 10, which is our answer here, choice 3. Notice they offer in choice 1, 5 times the square root of 10, and that, in fact, is just uh, the square root of 250 broken up. All right, hope this helps.